Aha! I don't know about you, but I'm on fire this morning. I hope you are having a great, great day. I want to inspire you today to look at challenges. Why do challenges appear in your life? And uh, the key idea here is to radically shift the way you perceive challenges emerging in your existence, whether it's in relationships or things that have to do with your mind patterns, things that have to do with professional success, your long-term evolution, spiritual, spiritual training or spiritual power. Anytime you face a challenge, you can look at it and think, what is the wisdom? What is the learning experience from that? Why is it that a challenge comes and hits you? And the real reason, the deep reason is because it forces you into evolution. It forces you to evolve. It forces you to change. It tests you. It sees, it checks in you what is strong and what is not. And so if you check human evolution and you check you know, animal evolution on this planet, you will notice that the moments where evolution is speeded up are the moments where there's a change in the environment. There is something that becomes hostile in the environment and then the species are forced into higher speed evolution. And so this is, this is true, for instance, when you have a mass extinction of dinosaurs because there is a meteorite hitting the planet, 95% of the species go, go ex extinct and only 5% survive. And out of those 5%, the totality of life that you see on this planet today, today has been emerging. And so when you look at your existence, when you get hit by something that has to do, for instance, with uh, relationships, right? Um, fights or breakups or jealousy triggers or stuff like that, you know, when you get hit by a challenge, what it's going to do is, is that it's going to force you to evolve. It's going to force you to look at your patterns and start changing what is no longer working. Okay? So it's very important to, instead of resisting the challenge, you know, instead of being resentful towards the challenge, you say, okay, well, it looks like life is testing me right now. It's telling me to look at something and go deeper into that. And so the same with mind patterns, the same with, for instance, your profession or career. You know, the moment you have a business that collapses, then it forces you to develop a new business or something new that is going to be stronger and more powerful. And um, when it comes, for instance, for, to, uh, you know, spiritual training as well, to your relationship to the invisible, the idea is to function with the same idea, the same kind of mindset. It is that instead of resenting challenges, you look at the wisdom behind them. You pause, you take a break, you just close your eyes and listen to what this challenge is really saying. And uh, you will notice that most of the times it is a call for evolution. It's a call for you to change or evolve into something new that you are not yet expressing or not yet manifesting. And, um, you know, very often the challenges are going to be shadows that are coming in your field you know, in the form of, of mind patterns or in the form of events that come in and, uh, and force you to, uh, to evolve. And so you notice that evolution is driven, is forced by precisely the shadows coming in and forcing you to move forward. It's a little bit like this fire burning in your back and saying, okay, well, you've got to move, man. You've got to keep on moving forward. It's otherwise you are going to get burned. And so this is the idea that I want to share with you today. The idea that uh, challenges are not a trick that is being played on you. <laughs> okay, no matter what you believe, it's not a conspiracy. It's not, uh, you don't have to be paranoia. On the contrary, you can develop a pronoia attitude. Realize that, hey, something is trying to teach me something. And the moment you start embracing it from that perspective, everything starts, starts changing because you see the wisdom and you see the power of uh, basically being extremely responsive, being flexible with what comes and, and hits your life. Okay, I hope this makes sense to you. I hope that you can, you know, look at, uh, at, uh, at challenges, uh, triggers, things that force you into evolution in the, in the future and uh, take more proactive steps rather than resisting, blaming or uh, being victimizing yourself into what, what comes and hits you. I love you. I'll see you soon.